guys and welcome back to my channel today for you I have a huge grocery haul it's massive I've been to one two three Costco Tesco B&M and pets at home so four places today so if you haven't subscribed please consider subscribing as we're bringing out new content all the time let's jump into this grocery haul first up is tesco's one of my twins needed a new duvet so that's there also there's a couple of us that need new pillows so we've got these ones these were reduced down from 25 to 12 pounds they're great for me in the garden or when i'm walking around because i'm on my feet a lot so that's good okay now let's get on to this food we have all sorts going on here i don't even know where to start let's start over here schler red grape sparkling fruit drink These slur are being put by for Christmas. So we have a slur rose, rose, that's a sparkling one. Whoop. And a white grape one. So they got put by for Christmas because we, we don't drink alcohol. So we have, all of us have a glass of slur with our Christmas dinner. And it's our quote pretend wine there we are mama's coca-cola one twinny's favorite drink of all time is a peach iced tea so i've got that in for him okay we have fruit winders strawberry and black currant then we have some self-raising flour i've got one of those and two plain flowers because I've been using a lot and baking season is upon us. Okay, now, next week, um, well, every week we do around the world. So every Wednesday, we pick a different country. This Wednesday that's just been was American, where we made biscuits and gravy. That was loved. Next week is Poland. So, this is not all that we've got from Poland, but this is a, a start. I've got to finish it off and work out a main meal. We have some crisps for the kids to try. They're obviously Polish. They're Polish hot chocolate. Now we already know this is delicious. <laughs> so we've got one of those. I had some Polish dried vegetable blend. I thought that would be good in a soup. We also have some iced gingerbread. Again, it's Polish, so that's good. We've got timber, which is also Polish, and that's apple and peach. We also have some seasonings that are Polish. Whoop. Looks like one for um, roast potatoes and one for chips. I had a guess I'm going by the picture obviously. So got those. Then we've got some fudge which is also Polish and then it looks like some marzipan and chocolate which is also Polish. So as I said it's not all of it but that's a start for our Polish next week. Now for the week after that we are having, I think it's Japanese. So we have got these in because these go in the freezer, which is great. They can just sit there and I don't have to over worry because what we try to do is we do something sweet. We do something, a main meal. Um, so we have like biscuits and a few candy sweets, maybe a pudding. So that gives you an idea what we roughly do out of it for each country. So we've got Itsu, Hoisin Duck, Goiza, and that's 12 dinner dumplings. We also have the chicken ones. So that's those, I'm gonna run out of space soon. Also, we have the Hoisin, Hoisin Duck 
buns and the chicken ones. So they can go in my freezer. So again, that one's not finished either, but it's a start on everything. Okay, let's get my chiller stuff ready. We have six pints of whole milk. We have a cheese and tomato pizza. We'd be doing a bouncing act. Okay, we've got pork sausage meat. This one was reduced to $1.99. Couldn't find another one like that, so I got this. And that is because my kids absolutely loved biscuits and gravy. So you bet I'm gonna have this in my freezer ready to go. So that's those. Aero mint chocolate mousses. They're gone. There won't be any left by this evening, guarantee that. Okay, some fromage fray. And that is strawberry, apricot, raspberry. So we've got those. We got some beechwood smoked cheese. My daughter loves that. And I think my number three loves it as well. Lemon mousse, that's that. Prime cuts honey roast ham, that was reduced. Bonus, that'll go in the fridge or the freezer, that won't last long in this house either. Some carrot batons, 53p, you know that's going in my dehydrator, because look. Oh, first time ever. <laughs> Nothing on my dehydrator. There is now. Four naan wraps. I love these. These, if you've never tried them, they are so good. Put them down. Okay, saw these and thought these would be brilliant for my kids to do. It says a three step kit. And it's Allison's and it's garlic and herb dough balls. I just thought it's something they can do independently without me. Got an autumnal little squash we brought, that was a pound. So there's that. Got some little happy monkey milkshakes. You've got chocolate ones and strawberry ones. Grow nutmeg, hooray! If you've watched my vlog, you would have seen that I used that one up. Right. Hula Hoops flavour rings, big, bold, and so irresistible, big and beefy flavour. Saw these Forest Feast Original Snack Explorers, salted caramel, milk chocolate almonds. They looked good. Got some Doritos, they're new to us. And we've got loaded pepperoni pizza and triple cheese pizza. Okay, I was out of everything chocolate chippy. <laughs> One of the better words. So we have two packs of dark chocolate chips. We have two packs of white chocolate chips. We have can't even see. Right. Two chocolate chunks of the milk chocolate. That's white chocolate chunks, extra dark chocolate chunks, an extra baking powder. This baking season, as I said, is upon us. Thought these look good, maybe to put into some muffins. But they sounded nice, so they're going in there. Okay, some biscuits, fruit shortcake, some digestive biscuits, some tropical tops, Mama's Reese's, and that's the peanut butter cups, Nutella and Go, the Kinder Cards. I've got two packs of these because these go so quick in my house, it's unreal. And then some little snacks packs that are new that I've decided to grab for myself is KP Nutastic roasted with a pinch of salt nut mix and that's almonds, cashews and peanuts. I've got dry roasted peanuts 
and fruit and nut mix. Juicy raisins, crunchy almonds, delicious peanuts. So that's that. Then we have this, I needed another lot of olive oil and I chose this one because it wasn't a lot of difference in price to my normal one but I've got a reusable bottle afterwards. I think the other one was about £8 and this one was £8.60 so for an extra 60p I got a reusable bottle so which you guys know I'm going to be using that not a problem okay let me get the receipt and I will show you how much that cost okay this is Tesco's And that was £134.87. Next up, pets at home. We have dogs and they inevitably end up with a bit of an upset tummy at times. So we needed another probiotic in. So this is what we've got, a probiotic and prebiotic paste that helps to soothe their tummies. An anti-guzzle for one of mine because he's wafting his food down and then trying to go and nick the other dog's food. So that's not going to help. And we've also got this for our third dog who prefers to be fed separate from the others so he has water and food into here. And then we've got the dog food. We've got High Life, turkey and chicken, flavour with bacon and vegetables. My dogs love this, so that's what we've got. We've got two of those. And that's the Pets at Home receipt. So the bowl was £9. The probiotic was 15 The double bowl one was 6 50 And then you've got the... the two lots of the feed and that all come to 55 pound and 50 pence okay BNM next and we've got a maths workbook we have two of those and two English that's for my kids because we're homeschooling we also have a massive box of shortbread that's going to be put away for Christmas some crisps salt and vinegar chip sticks some fruit and that cheese and onion ready salted salt and vinegar space raiders beef and pickled onion <laughs> <laughs> Six toffee crates. Got those. Mama treated herself to some false nails, so look up, look out for them on my vlogs and that. <laughs> they will be happening. Some fruit winders. A trifle mix. That I'm going to put away towards Christmas got some snack packs I thought these would be good for my kids for a snack you've got chocolate chip biscuits and honey biscuits I've got two lots of those okay we also have echinacea cold and flu relief saw those and picked them up there was only $1.99 that is handy to have in a herbal alternative some scrubbing pads, they were needed. Some more pens for the kids. I've got myself a tiny dinky little camera that I'm going to be trialing um, because I feel that it's probably a bit safer for me to have this one when I'm out and about instead of a big camera that I'm filming on. I just feel safer if it was small and discreet and doesn't stand out like a sore thumb like my big camera does. 
so I'm going to be trying that but I will have to have a SD card which I will order okay and here we got two packs of milk chocolate chips that's ready <clears throat> two packs of these are Capri's again these are for Christmas to put away so we may be doing Christmas a little bit earlier than most but considering we have five kids we have to get things in early because it's a lot that we have to buy so five kids plus myself and my husband and then relations and what have you okay I have a birthday coming up very soon so we have this hot chocolate set got a little gunk so a little book a little trinket dish a little birthstone pouch and a book so that's towards someone's birthday and on the gift theme we've got these in for Christmas presents we have two of these and it's got fruit cake, it's got blackcurrant preserve, tea bag, shortbread fingers. So it's a nice little set to give to someone. So we've got two of those in. Antibacterial wipes. These are handy to have in when you want to do a quick wipe round. I do a lot of my homemade fingers, but sometimes it's just easier to do this. Or if kids want to help clean. I know they're safe just using those, I haven't got to worry. Peanut and caramel trackers and a chocolate and peanut tracker, they're mine. And for peanut is normally myself or my husband's, not the kids because we have peanut allergies so mine has to be put up and out of the way. We have lion, wild, sweet and salty again, which is classed as mine. Oh, another pack of toffee crepes. Didn't think one would be enough. McVitie's Club. And that's mint ones. That's eight little bars in there. Saw this and thought my kids would love this tonight. Just as a little treat. It's Swiss Miss Lucky Charms Marshmallow Hot Chocolate. I think it's $3.99 from B&M. And I think I just think my kids are going to love it. White vinegar. You guys know I do canning, and what do you need? White vinegar. Saw this for £2 and thought, yes, please, actually, well, my son saw this for £2 and found it for me. These little baskets, oh my gosh, they're so cute. That's what they look like. Aren't they cute? They were £1.50. So I got two of them. I just love them. So that's those two. I've got some dumpling mix for when life gets busy. Three packs there. I do one lot for my kids. I've got some instant black tea with white nut. I'm gonna have a go at making my own chai. Obviously with the black tea. Now we've got Cadbury's brunch bars. And that's raisin and chocolate chip. Yes, both been opened. That needed snacks on the way trifle kit that's the second one of that this is B&M and that is £109.49 okay Costco yep I got one of them and one of them Christmas presents which is ideal and then for one of my kids which GCSE level my homeschooling we have this English language one then 
my oldest boy is working and he has to go out in the cold so we've got him this so it's nice and fleecy in a medium these were really good value so we've got him that one okay butter baking season I'm not going to say any more than that and what comes with baking season as well? Hot chocolate, squirty cream, yeah. Compostable food caddy liners, we're always running out. So I've picked up those. I've got 36 dinner rolls here. Some applewood cheese. And of course, the variety chocolate cookies. Yeah. Okay, we have Harpic Power Plus Toilet Cleaner. Yeah. Even though I use baking soda and citric acid, I still like this at times, especially when you're busy. And then cold and flu season. So tissues. So we've got those and then triple satin bath tissue 40 rolls 240 sheets per roll and lastly a hot chicken so Costco's receipt So, is £150, 63 pence. So that's them all. I'll give you a grand total in just a moment. So the grand total is £450 and 49 pence. Wow, that was a whopping grocery haul, wasn't it? If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up hit that subscribe button ring that notification bell that way you won't miss a video so until next time all take care